The entire first season of My Boys in four minutes? All right. Right off the bat, we meet P.J. Franklin and her buddies. She's a sports writer for the Chicago Sun-Times, and her life revolves around baseball and hanging out with her guy friend. We meet her brother Andy, Mike, who works for the Cubs, Kenny, who P.J. used to date, and Brendan. He's a DJ who breaks up with his girlfriend and moves in with P.J. Anyway, when Andy's wife makes him quit the baseball team, Mike brings in Bobby, a friend who's also a sports writer. He writes for the trip. So are you good? Um, I haven't played much since college. Oh, so like last year? She's funny. You didn't tell me she was funny. She's a barrel of monkeys. We also meet Stephanie, PJ's friend from journalism school. Then Bobby calls, and PJ invites him over. But she comes on a little strong, which kind of freaks Bobby out. So they're back to being poker buddies. Mike and Kenny bicker. Oh, Jenga, you lose. Bobby starts seeing Claire. What is he doing? PJ meets Hank. She's happy. He's Mr. Perfect. Good morning. Then Kenny's friend Trouty shows up. The guys aren't big fans. What's up, new guy? Bobby and PJ put their weird date behind them and agree to be friends. Cheers. What the hell was that? I have no idea. Andy's wife goes out of town and fun Andy cuts loose. Kenny sleeps with PJ's Aunt Phyllis. Morning, cutie. And your Aunt Phyllis. I gotta tell you. Uh, no, you don't. Mike gets fired, so PJ goes to his apartment and tries to cheer him up. PJ and Brendan admit they made out once in college. Then they take Andy Whoa. to Wrigley Field for the greatest birthday gift of his life. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Brendan finally kisses PJ, but something goes wrong, and he moves out and gets a new girlfriend. You rejected him. Look, I didn't know what to do. I'm sorry. Me too. We're going to Italy in the fall. PJ gets her big break on TV. Miss PJ Franklin! Here we go. <laughs> right. He puts the lotion in the freaking basket, you know? Oh my god. Make my dick. Uh, she kinda sucked. Sucked. You kinda swung and missed on this one. So you guys were just trying to be nice? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You guys are never nice. No, no never. Then Bobby gets a shot at him. PJ sort of falls for one of the Cubs. That is breaking like a ton of unwritten journalism rules. So there goes another one. And still, no date for the Italy trip. Stephanie's broke. I'm $22,000 in debt. Oh my god! And Bobby's rich. You live in a museum? Dude, who are you? Old boyfriend Thorne appears. <laughs> I can't believe you. Ew. Yeah. PJ and Thorne kiss. Then, the bad news. I'm engaged. Did Colleen do something different with her hair? That's not Colleen. No. Brendan becomes so full of himself that they call an yeah. intervention. Douchebag intervention. Hey, come on, man. Look at your belt. Hey, you know what? Look at it! Oh, my God. Yes, exactly. Andy invites everybody out to the suburbs for a barbecue. Oh, I like it. Kids, kids are fine by me. And PJ well, meets another nice guy. I'm a botanist. Mike brags that he can take getting hit no by way. a pitch. So it's off to the batting cages. Oh! Oh! The botanist reappears. I bought a boat. Let's do this! I sold the boat. Mike starts to like art. Kenny faces his fear of heights. You did good, buddy. I'm proud of you. The baseball player's back. PJ had two different men resurface and offered to come to Italy. Thor, how are you? I'm good. I'm not married. It's actually three. What? Who's number two? The cute cub. Who's number three? Thor! Then PJ actually invites someone to Italy. You made it. Want to know who it is? Who is it? Guess you'll just have to watch.